To the naked eye, this looks like an ordinary copper spring. But the copper also contains a small amount of zinc and aluminium, making it brass. But a modern brass, capable of changing shape according to temperature. When it's cold, it expands. When it's hot, it contracts. Exactly the opposite of other metals. It's an alloy with a memory of shape. This is due to these needle-shaped strands that, in expanding and contracting, alter the shape of the spring. As we move closer, the beam of the electron microscope lights up a tangle of strips. These strips have expanded in precise directions, giving this striated, ordered aspect. As some are in the background, they're in the shadow, so they appear darker. Fine rays can be seen on the surface. They were made when the spring was polished before being put under the microscope. Inside one of the strips, on the right, the surface appears chiseled. It's a fracture that occurred when the matter was formed. This spring is part of an electric fryer. When the oil in the fryer boils, the spring changes shape, activating a security system that prevents the lid being opened. Alloys with a memory of shape are difficult to examine. Alternating between two forms, the alloy is not as stable as ordinary metal. So it's difficult to distinguish between the atomic columns of copper, zinc and aluminium that are stacked up in all directions. <laughs> <laughs> 